Was coming you knew it was coming it was only a matter of time baby yeah you ain't perfect but you gonna be <laughs> yeah oh man okay but seriously where is the glue compressor What's good, everybody? This is a trailer for my upcoming review for Bitwig as a 3.0. Thank you to Bitwig for sending me a much very discounted review copy. And with that, I intend on delivering the most robust experience I can and informing all of you guys on why Bitwig is pretty awesome. This is going to be a series of videos that I'm going to be launching. The first video should be up by the time this comes up. And we're going to be kind of covering over some of the basic things. Of course, comparing to Ableton, as you know, that I'm a diehard Ableton fan and you know kind of giving a general overview of what to expect the first couple of videos are going to be covering the overview about how you're going to navigate through the program meaning that we'll be covering things like workflow audio and working in MIDI. Then I will be doing a second section, which will be covering the instruments of Bitwig, which includes the sampler, FM4, organ, phase four, and the drum machine. Then I will be covering the effects, both in MIDI and audio. And then I will be covering the grid, both in the effects and the polygrid functionalities and how all that works. And then finally, as a kind of closing comments thing, I will be kind of doing a direct comparison and just a relay of my thoughts on how it stacks up directly directly against Ableton. So I hope that you guys are looking forward to it. If you guys have any questions about this stuff, then feel free to reach out to me. I'm still going to be streaming. I have a lot of work on my hands, but I hope that you guys are interested. And if you want me to cover something specifically or you have a specific question, now would be the time to ask and maybe I can fit that in. So thanks guys. And I look forward to seeing you in my review of Bitwig Studio 3. Again, thanks Bitwig. You guys are awesome.